Canal side, where a mix-up almost left one local band sitting out of tonight's final concert. But thanks to the headliner, the show is back on. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jeff Rusak, live now at Canal Side. Jeff? Ashley, the show is getting going here at Canal Side right now. We've got Randall and the Late Night Scandal. They've started things off here. But earlier this week and even earlier today, they weren't sure if they would be playing here tonight. Now, two local bands. Kickstart Rumble and Randall and the Late Night Scandal were told they wouldn't be opening for the main act, the Claypool, Lynn, and Delirium. Now, managers for the headliners say they already have an opening and act and that that four bands would be just too much equipment on the stage. Now, officials with Canal Side offered to provide a second stage. That stage would have been out in the open, open to the elements, and the local bands didn't want their equipment to be rained on. So a storm on social media erupted for these two local bands. The Claypool Delirium found out about this and insisted local bands play a decision everyone was in favor of. It's going to cause quite a nightmare for the audio crew up there because now they got to do some adaptions. They uh, changed some of the set times. I know Kickstart Rumble got cut like 15 minutes. But I, I think it's all just about compromise and work uh, to make this happen. And, uh, it's great. I think you know everybody started somewhere, and it's a really you know just good testament to how dedicated those two artists are to music and to supporting uh, local bands, especially here in Buffalo. Randall and the Late Night Scandal. They are playing right now. In a little bit, we're going to hear from Kickstart Rumble, another band from here in Buffalo, and then a little later tonight, we're going to hear Lennon, the Claypool Delirium. They will be at at Canal Side, Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Jeff, thanks for the update. Now, tonight in